everyone, it's Michelle from Sense of a Woman and I just wanted to bring some attention to a new fall scent that I'm loving lately and it's a really pretty spicy vanilla that is um, a layering combo that I mixed with another scent and with um, this Restful Moon by Bath and Body Works. So um, this lotion particularly, it's a patchouli sandalwood vanilla. It's such an intoxicating combo and I just wanted to bring this to your attention because I think if you don't get this you're kind of missing out. So it's fall here in Colorado and today is particularly grey um, so my husband and I took a, a little fall walk with the dogs and it was just really beautiful outside. It wasn't super cold, um, I'm in a hoodie and jeans and boots today but I feel like the weather is just kind of turning crisp a little bit now and um, the trees are so pretty. You should see the colors, they're amazing. There's some like really vivid hues out and about right now and I'll put some pictures up um, so you can see what I'm seeing and what I saw on my walk today. It was just such a lovely fall day or autumn day um, rather so um, this video kind of inspired me to post this scent that I'm experiencing and using a lot lately. And I just think that it's such a lovely fall combo and I start reaching for my um, vanilla and gourmand scents a little bit more now because um, the weather is turning and I've been really into uh, the cinnamon and spicy scent profiles as of late. So. Um, I'm going to talk a little bit more about this next scent that I layer with um, another vanilla scent in just a sec. So I wanted to talk about Rebecca Minkoff. Um, this is a spicy vanilla and it has, I think, notes of tobacco as well. Um, it's not particularly gourmand. It's more of a spicy aromatic vanilla and this is what it looks like. I just got it and there's like a little sticker right there. Um, but this bottle is very pretty. It's quite heavy and solid. And I think this is a 50 mil. And um, when I first sprayed this, I uh, got kind of a vibe of Ani, Nishane, Ani. But I think that this one is actually better. Nishane um, scents are a little bit challenging for me. I think they're beautiful and they're well crafted and they're very long lasting but I found that Ani made me kind of nauseous. <laughs> it had um, some medicinal herbal quality to it that kind of made me feel kind of queasy and I'm not sure why but um, this one does not do that. This is like a more powdery, sweeter, um, really beautiful spicy vanilla and so um, let me just spray a little bit and just refresh my scent here but um, this is so beautiful you guys and it doesn't last super long um, on the skin it becomes a skin scent pretty quickly it lasts a lot longer on clothing this is a soft powdery spicy vanilla and I think it just is so um, gorgeous. I don't know if anybody talks about it on this community um, where we all sort of just hang out and watch videos about you know various vanilla scents and the same ones keep cropping up right but I haven't seen this one mentioned and it has tobacco but I, I don't detect like a, a weird cigarette aspect or tobacco aspect it just smells spicy and sweet and cozy at the same time so i've been um layering this with um juliet has a gun i just have a little travel size and mine has turned like a dark color i don't know if you can see that but i layer mine with um vanilla vibes and it is so good and it lasts quite a few hours on clothing um projection i would say in the first hour it's pretty strong um it's more of a scent bubble around yourself but i've been using this lotion and this lotion is um restful moon by uh 
Bath and Body Works and it's patchouli sandalwood vanilla. So it's very heavy and people have um, commented, I think a couple of moms, I wore this to a festival at my school recently, or not a festival, but like a, a birthday party rather, um, the school's birthday party. And I had this on with another scent and one of the moms was like, you smell incredible. And and then another person said later, oh, you smell really good. And I was like, oh, thank you. Um, but I just think that this sandalwood patchouli vanilla lotion combo kind of enhances your vanillic um, scents. And I just think it like adds a little bit of a booster and a little bit of longevity to your scents. So I really, really recommend this and this and the vanilla vibes. This is like a winning combo for sure. So I just wanted to throw that in there. This one is a little bit more powdery. I'd say it's more feminine leaning. Um, this one I think can be pulled off by pretty much anybody because it's got that like marine sort of salty quality to it. Um, it's just a really pleasing vanilla. It's not super sweet, but I really think this one on its own it's beautiful and with other scents that contain vanilla I think this is an amazing layer component um, layering component Juliet has a gun uh, vanilla vibes and I'm sad I've got this in a travel size I wish I had the bigger bottle um, I think it's on sale now one of the sites like fragrance.net or fragrance X has it for $99 so yeah if i were you get the bigger one and these you can find pretty much at macy's i think still has them i got this at tj maxx i want to say and i paid not very much for it it wasn't uh the suggested retail price which i think is like 85 or 90 bucks so yeah i think i got it for a lot less than that but Re rebecca minkoff and it's just the edp and it's the 50 mil and this is a beautiful sleeper scent don't like don't snooze on this one this is really great and my husband thinks it smells beautiful as well all right guys i hope you like the video and i hope you like the pictures of um our fall walk it's so pretty here in colorado right now and the weather is like super cool in the morning and then crisp at night and during the days, it's really sunny and beautiful. And I really um, hope that you can make it out here one day and visit Colorado. It's a really pretty state. Anyway, I hope you're having a great day and have a lovely weekend and get out and enjoy some nature. And we'll chat soon. Thanks. Bye.